So good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Here we are. Uh, this is going on week three of a peaceful occupation. Here we are going in week three of peaceful activists inside this embassy. My name is Medea Benjamin. I'm with Code Pink, one of the groups that has been here. And as of yesterday, the peacefulness of our protection of the embassy has been invaded by people who have come in to try to stop us from this peaceful protection of the embassy. They have physically assaulted the peaceful activists. They have been hurling verbal abuse since five o'clock yesterday. They have done destruction to the building. And unfortunately, the Secret Service police, as well as the Metropolitan Police, have been standing by and not doing anything about it. So we hold this press conference, and at the end of it, we are going to peacefully take the food down to the doorway there to get it in to the people who are stuck inside. How many people inside now? There are several dozen people inside. About 25. At least 25. So sorry about the noise pollution here, but this is part of the abuse that we have been dealing with since yesterday. I'm Mara Verhayden Hilliard. I'm a constitutional rights and civil rights attorney with the Partnership for Civil Justice Fund. I'm here on behalf of the peace activists, the American peace activists who have been inside this building lawfully present for weeks. What we've witnessed for the last few days has been an illegal, unlawful, right-wing, thuggish siege and assault of this building that is being facilitated by the Secret Service and by the DC Police Department who have allowed, watched, and facilitated violations of the criminal code over and over again, from assault, to breaking and entering, to property damage, to violence against persons, to violence against property. And they are allowing this to happen, and they are helping this to happen. We've issued a letter to the police department and to the Secret Service telling them that we will hold them accountable under federal civil rights law, under the Constitution, for their violations of fundamental rights of peace activists to be present. We need you in the back. They're drilling into the garage. Okay. The main thing that we need to make absolutely clear is that everyone here is lawfully present inside this building. And in fact, were they not, then law enforcement would be exercising some authority to remove them. But instead, what they've done is resorted to an illegal, fascistic, right-wing siege, attacking people, attacking the building, while the police and the Secret Service stand by. And we will not allow that to happen because it is only this group that is defending the Vienna Convention, international law that says that an embassy is inviolable property, that no one may siege, no one may attack it, but yet that's what the Secret Service is doing in violation of the law. All right, Mara's gonna go around the back to the garage where they are drilling into the vents illegally of an embassy.